All right, guys, now that I have my template laid out onto my sheet metal box, I need to get a student, a fellow student, to actually check off what I've done. So that means you need to go have an interaction with another student, have them come over, uh, put their fingers on each line, check off each individual part. Okay. Once you get the go ahead from your fellow classmate, we can move on to the next step, and that is heading over to the cutting table. Okay, so we're going to come over here. We're going to set our template off to the side. We're going to get out our aviation snips, and we are going to cut out our sheet metal plan here. Okay. Um, it doesn't matter where you start, just make sure that you cut next to your line. Uh, try not to cut your tabs off. Please don't do that. So make sure that you're holding it up to the light so you can see all of your lines and follow your lines and plans. Okay? All right, so I'm going to start out with my cut here. Make my straight easy cuts first. And don't forget, guys, you do need to have your safety glasses on. That's kind of a requirement to be into the shop. Remember when we talked about that in the last video? You leave the carpeting enter the concrete, you got to have your glasses on. Okay. Now that edge is pretty sharp, so try to keep your fingers back and do not run your fingers along the edge. That will prevent you from getting a metal sliver or poking your finger and bleeding. Okay. Notice how I'm picking up all of my scrap pieces here. They go right into this aluminum bucket in front of us. We do not want to sweep them on the floor. Okay. We can actually use those to recycle. When I go to cut my corners out in here, okay, I want to actually go down into my line, right tight to my line. So that way when I bend this up, that corner bends clean, looks nice. So I'll zoom in here for you. Okay, so got right down into my corner, my part fell out. Okay, so once you get done cutting it all out, you see how easy it was. What you're going to do next is actually have one of your fellow students come over and you're going to work with a partner and you're going to check all of your points and make sure that you got all of your cuts done. Once you get that accomplished, we're going to move over to the next table to do one simple task. So we're going to head over here right now. We're going to use this metal plate here and we're going to grab a ball peen hammer. Okay, so this is our ball peen hammer. You're gonna hold it in your hand just like this, so thumb, fingers, okay? We're gonna take and we're just gonna flatten out all of our cuts, okay? Because you can see right here how that metal's all twisted up, okay? So we want a nice flat sheet for the next step.
Okay, you wanna make sure that you're taking your hammer and keeping it flat against the surface. We don't wanna put any extra dents and dings into our sheet metal. You will be assessed on that later to make sure that your sheet metal is nice and smooth. So if you accidentally slip with your hammer and put a big dent in it, well, that's gonna count against your quality of your project later, okay? All right, we can move on to the next step in the next video.